Let me answer your question on uh, domestic violence. When I spoke here during the State of the Nation last year, I said, anyone who has never beaten his wife in the past 25 years must raise his hand. And I said, I'm, I can do that because I have no history of such things. I've never, not once, not my ex, not my wife, not anything, I've never laid a hand on my wife. I asked that question precisely because I got information that the president used to beat his wife, Norma Zizi, the late wife Order. of the president. Chair. Chair. May his soul rest in peace. Chair. I raised that issue because I no. said to the Chair. president, you cannot lead this against gender based violence. Chair, if you have order, not accepted that order, a woman is a point of order, 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 a point the fellow here is trying to deviate us from the fact of the matter here at hand. Why are you mentioning the president, mentioning others, blah, 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 Hey, Ruma, hey, what, 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 President Chief, get to the point, answer. Are you abusing your wife? Yes or no? Stop involving other members of the House here. Honorable members, the answer, honorable the members. answer is no. I have no yeah. problem giving that difficult. But I want honorable to... Members, honorable members, honorable members, please sit down, please. Honorable members, clearly there is a problem in the house. Clearly there is a problem in the house. Outside. One, Outside. Of, one of, of these problems, there's a problem now in the house now, but one of the problems that lead to this big problem is the fact that uh, Members stand up and they input on the integrity of other members. Now this kind of thing should not be happening in this joint sitting. Because if you do such a thing, Others would stand up and do the same. And the result will be, will be chaos and a general sense of disintegration and undermining, overall undermining of the house. So I am pleading with all of us to carry ourselves and to behave in a befitting manner. Conduct ourselves in a manner that seeks to ensure that we are able to carry out the responsibilities and the mandate that has been given to us as public representatives. The second problem 